defined for the compressor map, we we normally use a 20% margin between the search limit map, which is the actual kind of search, and the, this is the search component. Normally, there is 10% margin. So when the operating point crosses the SCL search control line, a PA control will open the recycle map. So a PA response is generated. PA response proportional and integral will give adequate protection, protection for small disturbances. So PA control will give stable control during steady state recycle operation. This is the steady state recycle operation. Slow disturbance example. But what if the uh, the, the surge comes very fast. When the operating point moves quickly towards the surge control line, the rate of change can be used dynamically in PP surge control margin. This allows the PLD controller to react earlier. Smaller steady state surge control margins can be used without sacrificing reliability. Fast disturbance. Example. So, uh, if the point, surge point, comes very fast to this point, we can use the rate of change, the derivative, this magnitude, to, uh, and give this much uh, high response to the control bar, which is also known as the cycle trip, the cycle trip response. We will see for the ahead. So, uh, so, this is the search control line, and this is the cycle trip line. And this is for the derivative action. This is the proportional and integral action, and the cycle trip line is the derivative action. So, this uh, operating point, when it touches the RTL, there is a quick response. For, uh, for when it touches the search control line, the response is PA response. But since the operating point is coming very fast towards the search limit line, it uh, we need a very, uh, uh, we need to open the cycle very quickly. Because if we do not do this, the uh, point may touch the search limit, the search limit line. So in order to protect it, we have defined another line, which is the recycle trip line. So when your operating point touches this recycle trip, uh, a quick response is generated. And this magnitude is equal to the derivative of this rate of change. And therefore, the total response is the sum of this PI response plus this recycle trip response. And therefore, the operating point returns back to this search control line. So, when the operating point uh, comes back to the search control line, the recycle trip response diminishes like an exponential decay. So, this is an exponential decay response. And the total response would be the sum of this and this. So, this is how the advanced anti search control algorithm works. Respondents are energy savings due to the smaller surge margin needed. Compressor has more turned on before the cycle of blow up. Surge can be prevented for virtually any disturbance. So, we can uh, reduce this margin uh, because, we know, because we know that there is another margin line we have defined in between. Uh, and then the operating point will touch this point, uh, this line, suddenly a search will be open, which will protect our compressor. So in this way, this margin can be reduced, but normally it is kept at 10% and the second trip line is kept at 5% with respect to the search limit line. Defined for the compressor map, we, we normally use a 